My name is Ro Martins. Currently, I am a junior fellow at the Ultrafast Bio Nanophotonics Group at the International Iberian Nanotechnology Laboratory in Braga, Portugal. Formerly, I worked at the Champalimau Center for the Unknown on the Immunosurgery Lab, where I made this amazing video with the 3D Cell Explorer from Nanolive. The lab focuses on adoptive cell transfer. We collect tumor infiltrating lymphocytes from patient tumor samples, surgeries, etc. and try to select the T-cells that specifically target the tumor. Later, we expand those cells in vitro until we have sufficient to inject back into the patient in hopes of eliminating the tumor. To select the best T-cells, usually cell sorting, flow cytometry and several other cytotoxic assays are the go-to techniques. But, coming from a microscopy background, I tried to implement more microscopy techniques in the lab and thus contacted Nanolive for a demo. It was an amazing 3-day demo where we fully tested the 3D Cell Explorer for our specific needs and produced this amazing video. We used the pancreatic cell line, PUNK1 cells, and CD8 positive T cells from a patient. Amazingly, the steps that took longer on the making of this video was the sample preparation and choosing the perfect region of interest to image. It's super easy to set up, choose all the settings, change samples, and there is no need for any type of labeling. And the laser does not harm the precious samples that we have, so long imaging sessions are advisable. After this amazing video, an amazing 3-day demo from Nanolive, we actually bought two of these microscopes, the simpler version of the 3D Cell Explorer, the CXF, and the more advanced automatic version, the CXA. And our hopes with these two microscopes is to finally know the end to our story and know why the T-cells behave the way they do in our samples.